Welcome back, everybody, to Book. Like that, I had a little more uh, energy because yesterday's episode, when I was editing it, I'm like, God damn, I had zero energy saying Book, and it kind of upset me. So I put a little bit more energy in this. I'm a little bit more awake too. Uh, I woke up at 11:30. It is now currently 12:11. So, you know, I had a couple more minutes to be awake. <laughs> oh, oh, I shouldn't cough like that. All right. You know, yesterday's episode, I didn't eat, I didn't drink anything, I just woke up and started recording. That's the problem there. Look at our village. Our village is fucking flourishing. It's, ah, it's flourishing so well that NPCs aren't even moving into these houses. Okay, so there was an update with the Fargo's mod. No idea what the update did. Probably should have read it, honestly. Um, and then, there's something else I wanted to do. There's a certain NPC I wanted to talk to you. I do want to wear this outfit, but I don't think the outfit looks cool. <laughs> like, the colors are too vivid for me. Ooh, that looks way better. This so this looks like something a ranger would wear. Who sells... Where's the claw of the air? When does he sell cowboy hats? <laughs> I do want a cowboy hat. These cowboy hats look pretty cool in this game. The only problem is our hair. That's one of my biggest things with Toria, is like... A lot of hair doesn't show up. Pretty much like 90% of hair doesn't show up when you wear most uh, vanities. It's really upsetting. Like beard hair especially. That's, that shit pissing me off because I want to see the beard hair. Oh, speak about the claw of the air. He keeps moving in over there. Why? <laughs> Do I have him set to move in over here? I didn't even know I could set him like that to always move in over here. I just thought he just moved in there by luck every single time. Uh... <clears throat> None of this really that crazy. You can keep him, my guy. All right, so we're gonna be fighting more bosses. You know how it goes. Let's go ahead. And we'll keep the events on. Jeez, I haven't done any of these events. I haven't done a blood moon yet. I don't even have a cosmolite. How the hell have I not done a blood moon? Hold up. Hold up. What am I missing for the cosmolite? We have the daylight or moonlight. We don't have the daylight. What do we need for the daylight? Hell, no, Souls of Light. Jeez, really, that's all I'm missing? We, you can tell we're broke right now, and because we don't have Souls of Light. We're gonna go all the way down to the bottom, because there's a hollowed biome down here, I think. So we're gonna go down here. We're gonna peep it out, check it out. Not peep it out, we're gonna check it out. <clears throat> Do I need to kill that guy? Probably not. Uh, Yeah, let's go up here. I've been having a lot of, this is gonna sound good. I've been having a lot of throat problems slash nasal problems recently. Not like serious problems, but like I've been having a lot of phlegm. Do you guys know what phlegm is? I've been having a lot of that shit. It's been bothering me a lot. And I don't I don't know how to stop it, man. Like I'm not like sick. Sick sick? I just have phlegm. And I really don't know how to stop it. The infernal hound is gonna be pretty hard to kill when I can't touch him. Come up here. Drop the mount, drop the mount! God damn it. How many times have I gotten that mount? The only time I think I've ever gotten that mount is because I wanted the mount for the the, the boss, not the boss, the god in that series. Who was that? The Casminicus is the one who got all the mounts. So like I don't know what to do there. We really do need to mine ores. I should just There's another way to do this. Another way to get ores besides fishing. There's those like bags from Antieris. That also give us stuff. I gotta look into it. We got a really easy anterior quest we could do. <clears throat> you can hear my throat just like stop working right there. My voice just be not giving out, but like like flame in my throat, dude. I don't know what to do about it. Pop more pills? I don't think that's good. Popping pills is never the answer. A message from Game Raiders 101. Respect the message. Okay. Let's go ahead and I'm gonna throw this in the garbage. Let's go ahead and store all that. And then we're going to make us our... Ow, I hit my hand on the mic. We're going to make the Cosmolite. Good old Cosmolite. Hey, you know what? I got to... People have been telling me to do this recently. A good bit of people. Check out my Twitch. My Twitch is twitch.tv slash gamers101. Obviously, wouldn't be anything else unless I said it was something else. Uh, I need to put like a Twitch advertisement in like the middle of my video. Just to, you know... Let people know that I do have a Twitch. How come no one lives in this house? Let people know that I do have a Twitch. And I stream a lot. I stream about four days a week. 
But recently, I've been streaming every day a week because most of you guys are off of school. Gives me a good opportunity to stream more for you guys. So we need to make a golden apple real quick. Oh, fuck. We don't have a regular apple because we auto trash them. Do we even have trees nearby? We don't. All right, so <clears throat> this is what we're going to do. Let's fight the brimstone elemental. Fuck the fallen angel for now. We will fight the fallen angel, but for now, fuck it. So let's, can I make a charred idol? Need some souls of night. Okay, sweet. <laughs> More souls that I gotta go get. Uh, this corruption over here to the left. So let me gather up a bunch of stuff. I wanna fight the brimstone elemental and I wanna fight the destroyer. Fallen angel. Maybe not the destroyer. I don't know. We'll see. But I definitely want to fight something else too. What is a scourge fighter? Use that knight. Summons the scourge fighter. The heck? Who will fight that boss? So I'm trying to fight a new boss every episode. Scourge remote. Oh, that's easy to make too. Alright, sweet. So I will be right back. I think I'm going to try and mine some ores. Get the materials for some bosses. Maybe some other stuff. But give me a couple minutes. Alright, I think I got everything. Not 100% sure. Oh, thanks for the golden apple mask again. Oh my god. 100% <laughs> worth doing. I'm gonna do more of those quests. I didn't know the loot was so good late game. God damn. I appreciate that, man. It's like when I get a follow or bits on Twitch. I appreciate that. Uh, hollowed bars. Hold on to those. Okay, Juice told me to make some stuff. There's a BFE. Um, which requires Kerbal Launcher, which I can't see because of the Chad's Furniture thing. I couldn't see the name of the item. Kerbal Launcher, we got that. And then there's also the like Mighty Bamboo Shoot or some shit. And then Juice told me that Icar Darts are like really OP. I also, I also picked this up when I'm uh, getting Soul of the Night. Yeah, so we got BFE. Boom. It's. I want it huge, unstable. Prone to overheating and a good chance it will blow up if you look at it from the wrong angle. I didn't become a Kerbonaut for an easy ride, damn it. I don't know where that's from. It has snail speed? Oh my god. Oh me, oh my, dude. Okay, and what's the other thing? <clears throat> it's like mighty bamboo shoot? No. Shoot. Just type in shoot. Boom. We got the ascended bamboo shoot. Alright, right click. Right click. Oh, this is pretty much the same shit. Pretty much the same shit, just late game. And then we got the quiver. Magic quiver, one of my favorite weapons in the game. Increase damage by 10% and greatly increase arrow speed. Is it just increases damage? Because it doesn't say increase range damage. It just says increases damage. That sounds really good, then. <laughs> what the fuck? That might be good to have, honestly. I have an item in here. It's not even in the mod anymore. What the fuck? What model what item is this? Item Necro Enchant? What item was this? I just updated Fargo's mod. Really? That ain't an item? <laughs> okay, I, I guess I'll put that in there. I guess we have an open slot now. Sweet, man. No, I wanted it to quiver anyways. I wanted it to be in our shit instantly. Beautiful. Now it's in our stuff instantly. Look at that. It's on our back too. Oh my gosh, so awesome. You guys don't know how much I appreciate when you can see an accessory on you. It's so cool. It's like uh, the Binding of Isaac. When you put an accessory on you, it just feels so good having an accessory on you. What do we get rid of? This is a real question. Probably this. The armor bane. You're cool and everything, but I don't know. But these weapons seem cooler. We're about to see what the... Oh my god. <laughs> what an explosion. Now, I've been wanting to play a lot of games. I say this all the time. Uh, that Kerb... I don't know what the fuck it's called. Kerbal Space Program? That game looks like a fun game to play. Same thing with Oxygen Not Included. Some people want me to play Oxygen Not Included. Some people want me to play Starbound. People want me to play everything. I'll get around to it. Don't worry. But uh, let's make some Icor Dots. I have no idea how to make them. Dots? Did I say dots? Darts. It's just Icor? Okay. Alright, we are down here. In the dumps. Let's do it. I'm ready. We just gonna spam right click this bitch. I'm sorry that it has to be this way, ma'am. You're beautiful. You're very thick. <laughs> uh, let's just, let's use this. It's not as OP as spamming Book's gun. I mean, she does hurt. 
Wait, why the hell do I have feather fall? I was wondering what the hell is going on. Alright, she's starting to hurt me a little bit. I'm going back to torturing her. You don't want none, bitch. You don't want none, bitch. You don't want none? You probably had surgery. That's why you're thick. Fake thick. Fake thick. We got a fake thicker. <laughs> gotta watch how I say that. Alright. Damn, she getting feasted on. Oh my god. <laughs> she, she teleported right there and just got blasted by that clip. Get the hell out of here. Alright. There we go. She almost killed us. Low key. But we're gonna pretend that we destroyed her. We fucking destroyed that hoe. Nice and easy. Wasn't even a problem. Get out of here. You guys wanna know a good way to make money in this uh, mod pack? Juice mod. Second anniversary. Let's do it. Big bucks out here. Alright, let's go ahead and let's stuff all this in here. But yeah, I wanna put this. I wanna see these in action real quick. Whoa. <laughs> Is that what that shoots out? Jesus. So there's no right click on it? Okay. Then this. This thing does a little ground pound thing. And then the Icor darts. I heard her OP. Whoa. It turned blue too. Whoa. <laughs> that shit like froze my game. That's how fucking strong it was. That's cool. I like that a lot. Alright. Let's go ahead and open this up. Brim Lance. Oh, that's a spear. That looked like a staff what you got these disgusting zombies snatch snatch fishing rod from my hands and broke it how am i supposed to fish without a rod can you please get out of the pieces and repair it so i have to go fish sounds like a lot of work <laughs> charred relic what wait oh wait it's not a my pets are off right now what wait is the mount a death mode drop it is look how big look how big this pet is jesus oh my okay let's let me see something real quick what, what can i make with this anything can i make a pickaxe pickaxe axe <laughs> what's it called pickaxe axe yeah let's make a pickaxe axe i like the pickaxe noises more than the drills drills i don't ride the drill hype all right I don't ride the drill hype. I'm sorry. We might just keep this axe the whole game. 850% axe power is pretty hard to beat. Like, at all. Like, good luck trying to beat that. You know what? One thing I missed from the spirit mod was being able to put those enchantments on my ship. That was a good time. Alright, so we're going to try and fight a fallen angel. We got to destroy three of these things. I was told by the mod dev. He said he's going to fix a little bit. Some, some. So the boss doesn't despawn as easily. I mean, a little bit of my fault not staying in the sky, but at the same time, he told me that the uh, Fallen Angel does take knockback. These lightning bolts, Jesus. The Fallen Angel does take knockback, so that's why it vanish so easily, despawn so easily. But uh, I'm going to tear this thing apart so we have some room to fight here. And I guess we jump cut until we fight the Fallen Angel. Alright, Chief, this should be it. That should be the last one. What was that? Oh, I picked up. Oh, I thought I picked up a spawn for. It. I always keep on thinking things are spawn for it. It looks like it. Whoa! What was that? I mean, it doesn't seem like she takes that much knockback. I think I just I moved too fast and she despawned. Uh, let's use the BFE. Try and get some BFE hits on her. What you doing? What's that? What's that shit? Oh shit! She deflecting. Oh god! Be careful now. Boom! Snail speed, this thing ain't too bad. Oh shit, I'm dying. I'm dying. You know what that means when we get close to dying. <laughs> okay, yeah, she does take a wee bit of knockback. Jesus. She almost flew off the fucking screen. Dude, she got some homing on her. What the hell? Get her ass. I don't want to die. I don't know if I buffed up or not. No, we still got our buffs. Okay, sweet. Boss is dead. Just like that. What is this? Zapper? I already have one of those. Got one of these last episode. Okay. Open this up. What we get? Infinity Cloud. Granting infinite jumps at the cost of mana. Interesting. It's very interesting. I have wings though, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, dark like essence. The fallen angel dropped this. It emanates a gloomy aura on one side and a happy one on the other. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. The holy machine. And gaze of the holy city. No. 
We don't want that one. Corrupt Halo. Interesting. Uh, Holy Machine, though. I will craft that one. So sorry if I don't use a lot of the newer mods we added to the pack. Uh, no, not unholy. Holy. I just forget them. I gotta do a mod pack that uses all the mods I don't use. I usually craft stuff for. That's what I should do. Just like focus on those mods. I don't know how good this is. The lack of sound makes me think it's not that good. <laughs> I still got this, by the way, which is like that Gatling laser and the magic Gatling laser, whatever the fuck it's called, and the UFO. I don't know how good that is. Okay, so we're gonna fight a new boss. The Scourge Fighter. I'm ready. I hope, hopefully I have enough to craft it. Yes, we do. So we just fight it at night. That's it. Just fight at night. We gotta be careful fighting at night, though. We'll go to the dungeon. Let's do it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm so ready. Whoa! That guy looks like he fights Scourge. Is that his name? Scourge Fighter? It is. What is it? What do these lasers do? They look like they're home. Okay. I really want to try to hit him with this. Let's see how good this is. Oh my god. Did you see that shit? Oh fuck. This is Shrek incoming. He's got that uh, abomination AI. Not AI. Uh, abomination like code that sends out. If we can get another point blank hit like that though. Ooh, that's clean. Oof. Oh my god. This is like risk reward, dude. I gotta get really close. It causes it. Makes it easier for him to hit me. But then I slaughter him if I land the hit. Get the hell out my face. You just got clapped, bro. Scourge Fighter. I feel like that's like. Definitely draws some inspiration from the abomination. Not in a bad way either. Whoa, Adventures Fishing Rod? Wait, we just get pieces of the rod? How many pieces we need? We need one more? Any more zombies? <laughs> right here. What's up, my guy? Come on, cough it up. We just need one more piece. One more piece. I don't think he'll drop it. I really don't think this guy will drop Oh my god, I keep missing. Maybe this is not the best weapon to use. Well, I mean, we could swing it the melee style. Wouldn't be that bad. We need some vanilla zombies, though. Vanilla zombies. Nope. It's like barely any vanilla zombie spawning. Isn't my spawn rate up 1.2.52? 1.2.5, not 1.2.52. Look, these guys drop another piece. Come on. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Look, you dropped a scourge. Okay, there's definitely some inspiration for something in there. Because we're picking up some interesting weapons. Alright, you, you want to talk about interesting weapons that aren't that interesting? These two. I'm sorry, I'm putting you guys away real quick. But I want to try this out. Let's see. More laser guns. We're getting a lot of laser guns this episode. Okay. Um, let's take out four things and put these all in there. And then let's make the adventurer's rod. Boom. No homo. Got it. Got my hands on the rod. <laughs> Can you actually use this? Oh. You break it. I didn't know you break it if you use it. It's got 100% fishing power, which is pretty good. Let's get my hand on this rod again, on the adventurer's rod. Uh, no homo. What's up, adventurer? Got my hands on your <laughs> What a great quest. You said that I broke the rod and you won't let me turn in the quest. Yeah. Have fun being dead, bitch.